also, I have one minute, I have chosen to set aside the Radiant Rose Soul series in September and to weave those discourses into other events. And I have chosen that in the September event, our two-day weekend is focused on health, healing, and wellness. The progress that we are seeing in your bodies as each of you have suspended taking in animals into your bodies through the eating of foodstuffs, the change through the sacred fire is remarkable. And I will say to you, precious hearts, we feel to bring to your attention rather than wait until spring 2015, I feel that at least your consciousness can start receiving ideas about nutrition and about how there are some kinds of spiritual nutrition, light nutrition, love nutrition, which each of you once your consciousness accepts it that you will come to a place where half of the nutrition that your body requires from food, plant life is, re is acquired by you from the physical sun. Imagine turning and facing the sun and receiving half of the nutrition your physical bodies require and are presently getting that trans that nutrition from the food chain do you understand and so of course measurably i'm going to might as well start saying to yourself that as all months pass into the future that you might start programming yourself. Take your regular portions, fill your plates and bowls as you usually do, have a side plate at the table, have a spoon and remove 5% of the portion and put it in the sink. I recommend, dear hearts, that you ready yourself for this. Jesus ate one meal a day and twice a day he had just some small portions and lots of liquids. It's just what happens to the resurrected body. You eat less, but you still love the delicious foods you love, especially those of you who will have the Messiah consciousness where the Christ introduces wonderful, new, delicious foods to the earth. Oh, I shouldn't have told you that. <laughs> Now you're all going to sign up to have that aspect of the Messiah consciousness in each of you. She is here for 20 minutes. Her name is the beloved Mother Mary. Her love for each of you is so strong. In the days before her son gave her her ascension, Jesus came to Mary and said, Mother, I come to take you to your freedom. And yes.